Okay, me and Matt here. Uh, and my first video of 2010. I think it, I think so. Um, I was watching Raw last night, and if anybody watched Raw last night, uh, Brett the Hitman Hart came back as a guest general manager, and I gotta tell you, uh, I knew it was gonna be shocking, and maybe a little, you know, Rocky, but what I saw was what I thought would never be possible, and that would have been Bret Hart and Shawn Michaels in the same ring since 1997, shaking hands and even hugging to bury the hatchet. I just, you know. It shows me a new respect for Shawn Michaels. I mean, I knew that he would want to also bury the hatchet and live his life and make amends. And just to know that that is possible and that can't happen. And so, I mean, yeah, McMahon came out and kicked him in the knee and Bret Hart. But then I just saw the... Highlights now about they came, everyone came in the ring and paid their homage to Bret Hart. And, you know, it doesn't matter if it's one night or as as much as they're going to have him. Uh, if they ever have him back. Um, but you know what? You know, to see him back in a WWE ring... You know, I was a fan when I was, you know, eight, nine, ten years old. And to see him in the ring once again, even after the stroke in 2002, to see him back, it, it really, it just really was amazing. Um, I still wouldn't mind if it was possible. To see McMahon and Hart at WrestleMania, but I I don't know if that's possible. It could be. I mean, it could very well be possible. Anyways, that's uh, what I wanted to bring up. I, uh, yeah, that's about it. So we'll talk to you later. And, uh, yeah, see ya.